Hey there, good people. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Seho. I also go by the name Harmonix. And uh, today we are shooting this wonderful camera right here, which is the Yashika D. And uh, we are in studio for the first part of this video. And then the second part of this video, we went out to Zoo Lake on a basketball court and we shot uh, some portraits. So basically what I did with the Yashika D is I just shot portraits of Njabulo. It was more of a test shoot. I just wanted to see what kind of results I could get with the Yashika D and if it's something that I could keep in my arsenal of cameras. Um, so yeah, let's jump right into the first session which is the studio session with Njabulo. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna talk through some of the images that I took and also I shot some uh, BTS. So I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, episode. And uh, yes, please don't forget to comment down below and let me know which one is your favorite image. You can even timestamp it so that I can go back and see which one it is. And uh, please do follow me on uh, socials. It is Harmonix ENT, one word Harmonix ENT. I'll put it somewhere down here so that you guys can see it. And uh, yeah, let's jump right into the studio session with Njabulo. So yes, the first image of Njabulo is of him standing beside the chair with his knee on it. Um, this is one of my favorite images from the portrait session, uh, from the studio session rather. And I don't know, um, it just describes the, the mood that I was in when I was shooting these uh, portraits. I was feeling very alone at the time and uh, this image just describes the mood that I was in. But in the same light, I'm glad that I went out and created something, you know. So yeah, let's move right along. Uh, the second image is of Njabulo sitting on the chair, uh, kind of like looking out over his right shoulder with his hand on, on the neck. Um, I like this image. So the Portra 800 is very warm. I'm a huge fan of it, but perhaps I should have used a, um, a tungsten uh, film roll with this, maybe a Sinistel 800T. Um, would have done a better job in preserving Njabulo's skin tones. But um, I don't know, part of me really enjoys the look of these images. And uh, the third one is of Njabulo sitting, laying back on the chair. I like the pose. In terms of the focus, it's a bit soft. Kind of disappointed, but that's one thing that I've learned from using the Yashika D. The focus for me is a bit of a touch and go. When I get it, it's spot on. And when I don't, it's, oh my gosh, what did I do? So this is one of those instances of, oh my gosh, what did I do? But I don't know, I kind of like the, the feel of the image. And um, I don't know, it, it, it gives me that film feel, if you know what I mean. But uh, yeah, you can let me know down below if it's something that you like or you don't like. So the last two images of the portrait session, I really, really enjoyed. Um, I like the feel of it. I like the warmth that the Portrait 800 gave to the images. And literally it's of Njabule just sitting on the chair and just giving me different poses. I'm very happy with, with how these ones came out, you know. Um, very vintage looking obviously, you know. So from here, we then decided to step out. I actually thought the, the shoot was done, but then uh, I checked with uh, my friend and he had some more time to play. And we decided to hit Zoo Lake and shoot some more pictures. And I'm not gonna narrate for this one. I just wanna share the images that I shot with some BTS and I hope you enjoy. And please remember to like, subscribe, and let me know below in the comment section which one is your favorite image and uh yeah let's go let's see what i got up to at uh, zoo lake with njabulo
Better hurry up. Uh, hurry up. Um, get that reading. Okay. Three, two, one. So yes, that was the shoot that I did with uh, Njabulo. It was a test shoot. Um, basically, we shot again Portra 800 and uh, the second uh, half of the shoot, I used Lomography's 400 uh, isoform. And um, before I love you and leave you, there is this one image that I accidentally did a, a double exposure on. Um, I kind of like it. And how it happened is on the Yashika D, there's this button over here. You, you press in to advance. So what I forgot was I forgot to press it in and then advance to the next shot. And that's how I accidentally came up with this double exposure. I kind of like it somehow. I love how the overlay of the flower is almost perfect on um, Njabulo's silhouette there. And um, yeah, that's it from me. And before I love you and leave you, don't forget to hit that like button and that comment down below and let me know which one is your favorite image and until the next time, this is Harmonic signing out. Peace.